I was just listening to the new music video that I'm releasing. But why are you always promoting all your stuff on my channel? Well, it just released today and I wanted to tell everybody. Uh, no, get your own channel. Like, stop messing around with mine. I got a reaction video to do. <laughs> okay, again, I'm sorry. Just like your channel. It's better than mine. Man, you'd be a lot more successful on your channel, not mine. <sighs> Hello! What's going on everybody and welcome back to another reaction video. Today, it's Friday, so that means it's Foreign Friday. And we're here to react to a new foreign artist that I've never heard of. And he's from a different country. He goes by the name of Akala, I believe. Akala? Or Akala? Akala. Akala. Got me on the name. But it's a fire in the booth. It's gonna be part one. And there's four parts. So we're just going to keep continuing on the Foreign Friday Fire in the Booth series. So let's just keep going with it. Hope everyone's doing well. Let's go. I know you're going to dig this. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Yo. 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 Okay. Yo. Yo. I like you. You're like a tiger. Yes, I grew up on a doll in a single parent family. Been through a little bit of tragedy. Yes, I was around drugs and violence before the day that I started secondary. That's part of it, not half of it. Get the picture, the rest ain't necessary. Growing up, got a little caught up. That ain't even half of my life. Also, given the knowledge of self, that is all we actually need to survive. If you saw me, age nine, reading Malcolm, just fine. Teachers still treated me stupid. Students that couldn't speak English, they put me in groups with. The irony is, some of the first man to give me schooling, you were called gangsters. I already explained that we know what the truth is. They used to say, they don't be like me Yeah, I got a name and don't on the street Night time comes, I can't sleep It's the part that rappers don't speak We don't hit the road cause we're thugs Don't come out the room, wanna sell drugs If we got the right guidance and love Would we fight people just like us? How can I knock the hustle to get by? How do you think I ate as a child? Judge no one, done many things wrong Just don't boast about it in songs But listen to my older bars I was just as confused as you probably are But you grow when you learn Travel one, cut One too many man, you know, get caught up One too many man that could have been doctors End up spending the whole life boxed up You learn if you study So set out just to make them money, no cover It's all about getting poor people to fight with one another So it's Perfect. logical that us killing our brothers Dissing our mothers is right in line With the dominant philosophy of our time But time is a cycle, not a line Comes back around, you regain your mind You be ready for the energy Ooh. of challenge in my rhyme Remedy the pedigree, the jeopardy your mind When the world is left it is a crime We can all fight with the brothers over crumbs Harder to fight the one who makes guns We can all talk sh get two dollars Harder to be the one who seeks knowledge If we understood economics with no money's nothing Think nothing of it, money is a means to get wealth Not the wealth itself and don't get confused far from Broke all that you see me do I own But I won't hang what I make around my neck I know from where that the diamonds came But I do literally own a library That definitely costs more than your chain And businesses and property Far from starving I eat quite properly and I don't care Just said it for the kids You need to know you're not broke to listen Don't know an asset from a liability They've never been shown nor told the difference So they don't change situation Which is mine in Britain is Asian That's significant Not coincidence Asian people build businesses Not by flossing Going out shopping Giving up the culture for everyone's profit Who runs Bollywood? Indian people Who runs our ish? So we shake our ass and dance as if racism just upped and vanished But has it? No, it's right on course You're beating so bad you're trained to ignore Let me not just make sweeping statements Give me a second, I'll explain it For small amounts of drug possession There's more black people in jail in America The net is for rape and armed robbery and murder All put together You can say they're just locking up tugs Imagine they're in prison every middle class kid that had ever held drugs Oh, that's right, that'd be your kids Bigger than that, what is going on with this? Prison in America's private business They get paid 50k per year per inmate by the state Facts. Just wait, also legally are allowed to use their prison inmates as slaves Cheap slave labour, big corporations They come out of jail when they can't get a job So when we celebrate going to jail We are literally celebrating enslavement Add to that, that the hood that you live in Engineered social condition that breeds crime by design Where do you think you get your money? And you can say that they're just black But I like to deal with facts In the 1920s, you would have found in America Black towns, prosperous Centers of economics to education to make you proud But some people couldn't bear that the former slaves would not just lie down to the KKK and other hate groups Burn those towns to the ground, killing hundreds if it ain't understood You think you were always living in the hood, it's only been 60 years Since the hung blacks and burn them and that was so cool They were your baskets, picnic baskets, even gave kids the day off school Go see a lynching, have a picnic, it's fun to watch the little monkeys die And people act a little dysfunctional, you wanna pretend that you don't know why Hmm, just uh, 
pointing out that he just said six. It's been sixty years, uh, you know, since oppress oppression and how they weren't allowed to mingle with the whites. Um, I also heard today coincidentally, that um, it's been over just over 60 years since, um, you know, all these taxes started to come into play. And, uh, you know, um, kind of what he was talking about with the whole slave system. Yeah, it's a little weird. If your colour means you can be killed and you're powerless to get justice about it Is it difficult to figure out how you would then end up feeling about it? And that ain't excuses, just dealing with the roots of abuses that make a reality Where a generation of young men speak of ourselves as dirt casually That's America, this Britain, something similar, some different In this country, the first enslaved were the working class What's change? Worst jobs, worst conditions Most tax, look where you live and yet you go to the pub Friday night you will fight with a guy, don't know what for Won't fight with a guy, shoot in a tight who send your kids to die in a war They don't send the kids to the rich or the politician, it's your kids the poor British are the same to go and die in a foreign land For these wars that you don't understand Yeah they say you are British And that lovely patriotism they feed you But in reality you have more in common with immigrants than with your leaders I know both sides of my family Black and white are fed ghetto mentality Reality in this system Poor people are dirt regardless of shade But with that said let's not pretend that everything is the same When our grandparents came here to Britain If you had a criminal record you couldn't get in That ain't protecting from all of the stupid stupid abuses they were living Kicked in the teeth, stabbed in the street Many times firebombed our houses, put feces through our letterbox and of course the cops did so much about it daily up to the 80s people spitting in my palm because i was a goofy baby but of course that has had no effect on why today we are crazy and none of this was for any good reason they were just dark and grieving to ease the guilt now for all of this treatment constant stereotypes are needed so if i celebrate how big the f*** is not that are flipping clips that are sticking chicks that i'm hitting i'm playing my position but if i teach a kid to be a mathematician messing with the schism how they gonna fill a prison when materialism is no longer our religion what do you think we got now in britain just like america private prison prison for profit that mean when your kids go jail people make money off it so keep environments that breed crime build more jails at the same time market badness to the kids in the rhymes long as rich kids ain't dying it's fine get them to the point where some are so lost they actually believe if they don't celebrate killing themselves off that it's because they're soft was malcolm soft was marley soft tell me was marcus garvey soft well was muhammad ali soft nah nah i think not but they want us to think that the road is cool being on road is all we could do we don't control the whole cell production so who benefits from us moving the food or thinking there's no way out of old life but malcolm x used to hustle on the roadside and marcus garvey organized more than six million people with no facebook or twitter why is it something you can't eat Ish. one of my own homeboys did a 10 straight in the boxing yard now what's he doing passing his doctorate don't tell me that it's too hard who trained you to I believe you're inferior song boat ever though in Nigeria are the remains of an ancient moat dug 1,000 years ago 20 meters wide 70 down round the remains of an ancient town that's 400 square miles around 400 square miles around please please don't believe me it was a documentary on BBC but we ain't studying history too busy watching MTV and MTV said wear platinum that's now everybody true. wanna go and wear platinum and MTV said pop magnums now everybody wanna go and pop magnum and MTV said drink prune juice you will start hearing that in tune soon hey today I wore my car yeah is it now more important what I got to say oh when i drive a mercedes by the way so everybody listen to what i got to say huh. does that make you all happy ah oh, but sh if my head's still nappy think for myself so some mad at me but on the mic it not one bad as me all of this here's good for the rhymes put us in the same place at the same time and it's clear to everybody i'm out of my mind some of these guys are running out of the rhymes clear to everybody that has got ears i'm the guy that they just might fear that they want to get near but they can't have a peer all day i'm hard like you just like beer front on the kid for another five years come to my shows and some criteria mean that much to him it's a movement i don't speak for myself but a unit black white man Woman, anyone who respects truth, we put in. Dudes are like no dinner, we're just pudding. Yeah, you're sweet, but no substance pudding. You can never ever be yeah. with a level on. Our songs get played out there in Lebanon. We speak for the people properly, not for the old fat guys in offices and the girls loving. It ain't fair, you can't even be bothered to comb his hair. Anyway, that's enough kissing my own ass. Back to the more important task of being so shower. I've got half the hood screaming, knowledge is power. And I ain't saying that'll change that, that. But I do know this for a fact. Right now, there's a you on your block with his hands on his hood. His face screwed up. So he don't care, don't give up. That he won't let nobody call his bluff. But the words go in, open your shack covers once that's happened There is no going back, or would you start to see what is really happening? Who the enemy you should be attacking is So read, 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 stuck on the block, read, read Sitting in the box, read, read Don't let them say what you can achieve Cause when people are enslaved, one of the first things they do is stop them reading Cause it is well understood that intelligent people will take their freedom Cause if we knew our power, we would understand we can't be held down If we knew our power, we would not elevate not one of these clowns If we knew our power, we wouldn't get arrogant when we get two pennies If we knew our power, we would see what everybody Everybody sees that we're rich already But never mind MCs go run for your mummy I'm hungry, I run for my tummy That's enough, back to worshipping money yeah. I'm off, back to the study Ooh. Man! Bit in the fire Mike, 
has been fun. In the state records. Now that is what you call fire in the booth. Now we come with real crazy fire, fire in the booth. The balls are crazy. The punchlines are crazy. You had a and that was, if I'm saying his name correctly, Akala. Fire in the booth, that's only as part one. It was 12 years ago, so yeah, the quality is just gonna get better, and obviously his skill is gonna get better, so we're gonna keep checking him out. So I'll see you again next Friday for Foreign Friday, where I check out foreign artists from foreign countries that I've never heard of before, and dive in and see what they're all about. So if you don't know who this guy is, I'll leave all of his details in the description below, so you can go check that out, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to help this channel grow, and I'll keep making reaction videos for you, and you can just let me know what you want me to react to, and I'll get to it. I also just released a new music video today, so if you want to go check that out right after this, just follow the link at the end, just click on it, and it'll take you to the music video. So that's it for now. Foreign Friday is over, and I hope everyone has a good day, a good night, whatever it is for you, and peace out, my friends.